What's up my friends, it's Mr. Ryan Jones here with a video training today on how to search for anything on the internet 10 times faster and more effective. Let's get right into it. Let's go to Google, or since we're in Chrome, I don't know why that happened. But let's say we are looking up a image where we're trying to find an image of a black dog. Black dog pictures. Okay, we want to know the different types of black dogs. Maybe we're doing a research on it, and holy crap, that is a really big dog. All right, well, normally what you do is you go to uh, Google, type that in, and they give you the image results first, which is smart. And, you know, this is how I used to search for images on the internet. It was either through Google, Yahoo, Bing, whatever, it doesn't matter. Well now, there's a plugin you can install in your browser that, you see that right there? Click on this, that basically eliminates the need to even go to the Google website. Look at this. See how these images are? Look at all these different. These are all the image results from Google.com but they are laid out a lot better than what you would see on the website, on the Google website. And look, there's just loads and loads and loads and loads of images of black dogs, what we typed in. Well, let's say this one right here catches our attention. Well, what you do is, look, it, it pops up here. It shows you the picture tells you the the images the or the 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 title of the image let's not use that one for some reason it's not popping up the um, URL okay let's say we're going to use this one here the big black dog you've got the title the image URL here you have the ability to share it um, right there to mark it as a favorite or to actually go to the web page where the 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 thing came from the image came from so let's click here and voila, we've got the image. Save the image to our computer, and we have an image of a black dog if we wanted to use that. Now, not only is that good for this cool Iris plugin, good for Google Images, it's also good for Bing, Flickr, Hulu, YouTube, Blinks, and they have their own little categories themselves. Well, let's let's, let's search Hulu. I know Hulu is a very popular, becoming very popular. Uh, because they have a lot of the different uh, videos that a lot of the people can't put on the internet because they buy the rights to them. Well, let's say this, let's, we want to go through in here and watch Family Guy episodes on Hulu. And look, it, it popped right up right here. We don't have to go to Hulu.com and search it and go through different, um, whatchamacallit, different, different web pages. We have all the stuff we need here. And they're going through and finding every single result on Family Guy on Hulu. And let's see here. Let's say we want to we want to watch the um, Stewie's commercial interruption from Hulu. Gives it just a minute and it loads up just as if it was on actual Hulu. So it's just a cool little tool. It blow, loads up here. I'm going to turn it off before it starts. And yeah, another great thing that I discovered about this is um, it's good for Facebook as well, too. I'm going to use an example here of a friend of mine. I guess it popped up on my, um, my feed here. Uh, Therese Mew, she's got a picture of her and her son here. And what you can do is, instead of uh, going through here normally like you have to do on Facebook and go through different things, you can click on the cool iris thing and it pops up here and it shows you every single image from her album, Family, uh, in a little 3D, little 3D uh, sent little thing here. And it, you know she's got a little captions here. And you can go and click on the picture, and it shows up just as if you were on Facebook, and these are directly from Facebook. 
So it's just a pretty neat plug-in. I uh, wanted to share it with you real quick, and I will uh, I will talk to you soon. Take care. Thank <laughs> you.